here at PC Classic Car, Sherman, Texas. Here to do a professional inspection on the 65 Mustang Fastback. Welcome. I frequent this establishment. Let's do the walk over here. I believe it's straight back. Hope everybody's doing well today. Oh yeah, that's the one. How are you, sir? Doing good. Here to look at a car. Don't mind me. Here's the initial look. A little 65 Wimbledon white, blue interior. Let's do a walk around. Told it has an older paint job. Have a look under the hood. We'll start under there. First, first things I like to look at under the hood. Check the under fender wheels. Get her in the light. I just want to get a good look at it running cold and warmed up. Let it idle, see if they get hot. This one does not have a shroud. So that's going to affect it in the two feet, sitting in traffic and whatnot. It's not spewing. I don't see evidence of a lot of heavy overflow spewing. That's something I look for. I look for leaks on the motor. See if it's been actually gaskets replaced or if it's just been painted up to look nice. To get a good look under there. You want to check the firewall for rust. The force supports. See, this has been hastily repainted. Look. It's spray painted. Up. Right under there. Otherwise, the metal looks solid. pressure it's running cool sitting out here in 95 degree heat It's 
actually riding smooth. Yeah, it cruises good. Has it tracking? The steering looks straight. Yeah. Got a little bit of play, but we've got to get against, against the crosswind here, so I mean, not bad. But we've got a little bit. Steering wheel's off center. Fold down rear seat. Yep. Yeah, our temperature has come down a little bit. I think our thermostat opened up, so we're running about right at 200, which is good. Much better. That's what I was saying earlier is 100 degrees out here sitting yeah. there idling. You got to see the fold down rear seat go down. That's always entertaining. Look at that. Who needs a Corvette when you can do that? Two-seater. Look at that. Fold down rear seat option. Always a favorite in these 2 plus 2 Mustangs for me. Classy little Wimbledon white driver, I'd say. Not perfect. Older amateur paint job as the dealer describes it I'd say that fits it well got some paint flaws when we really start looking up close some trash in the paint a little bit of misalignment here and there on the headlight buckets a little misalignment on the door See how the gaps out a little on the fender, top to bottom. Doing my thing. Look for previous repair up here for welding work, bondo work, that kind of thing. Make notes to my client. That's some beautiful work there. Not. Who the lights? Fog lights? Yep. Yep, left and right, yep, yep. <laughs> All working. Let's show them the back too. Yep, yep. Try the reverse lights. Yeah, we've been cruising. We've probably been four or five miles on it, and our temps dropped down under 200. It's doing fine. Drain oil pressure. It, it doesn't have any evidence of overflow under the hood either, because it doesn't have an overflow tank. Oh, it's just the hose. Yeah. yeah, and it's not splashed all around down there. Yeah. So yeah, she runs good, drives good. A little bit of a squeak up there in the left. I think Michael's going to have a look at it, he said. Talk about greasing it. Maybe? Yeah, we'll take a look at it. It don't seem to affect the ride of it. Nope. It's not shimmying. No, steering wheel's not shaking or nothing. No. How are the brakes feel on it? They're alright. They're for, for manual. They're, uh, you 
got to press it a little bit harder to get it stopped, but nothing that's scary. They're not walking all over the road. Up here, I'm on the brakes now, and we're stopping straight. Yeah, yeah. Clutch feels good and strong in it. I'm gonna get out and get you just buzzing off so he can see the exhaust that it's not smoking. Yeah, and I'll come back and pick you up. Okay. Just in one frame. Okay. 